So in my left hand, I'm holding an Eleiko power bar, a stiff bar. In my right hand, I'm holding a deadlift bar. I'm gonna load these two bars up with 500 kilos and check the difference in how much they bend. The deadlift is considered one of the greatest lifts to measure strength in. It's one of the three lifts in powerlifting and it's also real common in strongman in one way or another. So the deadlift can vary a lot depending upon straps, suits, hitching, different kind of bars and also federations. The main difference between these two bars is that the deadlift bar is 2.3 meters long and has a diameter of 27 millimeters and the deadlift bar and the, and this power bar the stiff bar is 2.2 meters long and has a diameter of 29 millimeters so in my left hand i'm holding an eleiko power bar a stiff bar in my right hand i'm holding a deadlift bar i'm going to load these two bars up with 500 kilos and check the difference in how much they bend so i'm going to use this eleiko deadlift jack uh, for this and it's for two reasons it's easier for me and it's also approximately where both ray williams and Hafter bjornsson uh, hold on to the bar with the deadlift so i have loaded up the bar with a five kilo plate a full size five kilo plate i'm gonna ch check how far it is from the ground till the bottom of the plate and it's almost 15 centimeters it's around 14.8 centimeters so we're going to load up 100 kilos, 200 kilos, 300 kilos, 400 kilos, and 500 kilos. We're not only going to measure to see the difference between an empty bar and 500 kilos. We're also going to measure to see the difference between 100 kilos, 200 kilos, 300 kilos, and 400 kilos, up to 500 kilos, to see the difference between the plate as far as out on the bar and the ground. So we have now loaded up 500 kilos and when we had the 5 kilo plate on there was 14.8 centimeters uh, to the floor and we will see now what the difference is from the plate that's uh, farthest out on the bar down to the floor. 10.5 centimeters so that makes a difference of 4.3 centimeters in the bar band from more or less an unloaded bar to the 500, low, uh, 500 kilos on the bar. So only 4.3 centimeters difference with 500 kilos on the bar. I would say that's, uh, that's a pretty stiff bar. So we're now gonna unload the 500 kilos from the Aleco bar and load up 500 kilos on the deadlift bar and see how much it bends. So you have to know that this test is primarily to see the difference in the bar band for the bigger guys like Ray Williams and Haftor Bjornsson. If you're a smaller lifter or pulling sumo, you will have a narrow grip when you deadlift and a narrow grip will give you a greater bend to the bar. Fourteen point... Yeah, fourteen point eight. Uh, so we'll load up, the same as we did with a stiff bar, 100 kilos, 200 kilos, 300 kilos, 400 kilos and 500 kilos and check the difference. So we managed to load up 500 kilos on the bar. The distance from the plate far is out on the bar, full size plate, to the ground is 5.5 uh, centimeters. Uh, the difference is 9.3 centimeters from 14.8 centimeters to 5.5 centimeters. The difference between a deadlift bar and a Leiko stiff bar with 500 kilos on is 5 centimeters. So if you're one of these guys that's aiming for a 500 pull, 
the deadlift bar will save you five centimeters on it. But we have seen 500 kilograms deadlifts with this deadlift bar. I would like to see a 500 kilogram deadlift with a Leiko stiff bar. If you liked the video and want to see more of this, you should probably not subscribe to this channel because I probably won't be doing more videos like this one. Though if you're into old powerlifting videos, I can provide you with that. In the left corner you will see a playlist that's filled with over a hundred old powerlifting videos. And there's a lot more where that came from. Thanks for watching, if you really enjoyed the video, please leave a thumbs up.